team creative guys welcome back we are doing organization again today today i decided to bring you guys some essentials for your work bag and you can make this work for any type of work bag that you have um depending on what type of work you do you need to tailor this to your own needs but i work in the office and right now i am back at work about three days a week my son is still virtual learning one day a week guys so because of that, I have to transition back and forth and I need all of my things to be ready to go. Don't want to leave anything. So when we're running in the mornings, I want to make sure I'm ready to go. So I'm just going to show you some essentials. I have two bags here. This is my bag that I usually told guys. Um, I was given this bag as a gift by my kids and my husband for Mother's Day. So I'm not sure where to purchase it, but I will try to find some links. I did also grab another bag that I had uh here in my closet in my purse closet guys and it's a tote um both of these are totes this one came from belts it's much more affordable um so i just wanted to give you guys an idea you can grab a beach bag whatever you grab just make sure the straps are pretty sturdy guys so i grab totes because i specifically like totes because they are open they're open easy to get into and you have no trouble grabbing what you need so for today's purpose, I'm going to start out with the uh, designer bag here because this is the one I told every day. But before I jump into that, guys, I'm going to show you a way to dress up your purse or your everyday tote bag. Now for this one, I really wouldn't do it because it has a little decor on the front already. But if you want to make your bag look fancy, guys, I learned this from another YouTuber, um, Nikki. So thanks, Nikki. You can buy a hair scrunchie and I actually picked this one up from I think Walmart for like a dollar on clearance and you just put the scrunchie in front of the bag guys around your handle you pull your straps through the scrunchie and then you fluff it out to your desire and how you want it to look I'm doing this backwards guys so because I'm not in the camera's view so here we go pull it through and then you just put it on the handle there we go and you fluff it out so you have a little bit of decor now like I said this one already has some decor so I wouldn't do it on this bag but that just gives it a cute little bit of flair you can change it out once a week daily whatever you like so let's jump right into the center of the bag guys because if you're moving around guys want to go to the park um need to go back and forth you need to have everything at your fingertips so first of all the first thing i have guys are just my essentials um i keep an umbrella in my bag and you can see that there in the pocket um this is my case for my sunglasses or glasses whichever one i decide to carry i always keep a pack of wipes especially now um some type of bacterial wipe to wipe things down if i need to wipe my kids hands um we have something on hand um so this is my water bottle guys love my water bottle it's like a yeti keeps things insulated so it fits right down in my bag and then my of course essential is my ipad so i keep my ipad in here in addition to my ipad guys i always keep a notepad and this little notepad i picked up i think from tj maxx for 5.99 but it allows me to keep all of my essentials right there where I can just write notes. Anything I need to write notes about, if um, I get a thought, I can grab it and jot it down. So it's always good to have a notepad. I keep several of these around, guys. So the next thing is I keep everything divided into sections. So I have a lot of little clutch bags. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys, of course, I have my planner. So this is just my daily planner. Um, the little dividers here, I think I ordered off Etsy, guys. Um, I'll try to drop a link for you below. So that's my daily planner. And then this first clutch bag that you see is just what I call my tech bag, guys. And so there's not a lot in here. I keep a few pins in here. I do keep a few wall plugs in case I am somewhere and I need to plug in, charge something, I have it. I make sure I keep 
all of my chargers to my iPad and my essentials in here and if I um, need to reference quickly a lot of the times I will label them and put initials so that I recognize what it is and it's easy to go because if you start gathering these things it's hard to keep up with them so this is my tech bag and then the next clutch bag guys that I keep in here is just a quick little pencil bag nothing special this is where I keep my pencils. I keep all of my business cards in here. And then again, guys, like I say, I always keep little notebooks around. So this is just a notebook I think I grabbed from the dollar store. I thought it was cute. If I'm going to a conference, going to something for the office and I need to jot down notes, I can put it in there and it is easily accessible. And then the next little bag, guys, that I have, and you see how easy it's just going back down into my space is my personal care bag now this bag I bought it's a little flirty um, bag that has the little clutch handle on it it has a tassel on it so I can easily identify this as my personal bag so in my personal bag I just try to keep daily needs as you're in the office if you're eating lunch you always want to be able to freshen back up so I make sure I keep dental picks in my bag I often keep a travel toothbrush in my bag um, I have some more hand wipes so if I'm sitting at my desk I can wipe my hands off um, ladies I always keep a feminine wipe in my bag we want to be fresh if you're going to a late evening meeting you want to make sure that you're able to freshen up I keep two lotions so this first lotion is a eucalyptus just stress relief from Bath and Body Works when I'm stressed middle of the day after lunch rub this on my hand it calms me the other one I use more so if I'm going to a meeting in the afternoon. If I want to have a little bit of fragrance, smell fresh all over again, I wash my hands, clean my teeth, chew some gum, and rub this down, and I'm ready to go to my meeting for the afternoon. I also make sure I keep some type of Tylenol or ibuprofen. In this case, I have ibuprofen. And then, guys, in the bottom of my bag, I just keep a few mints. So, ladies, those are my essentials for my personal tote or clutch that I keep down in my tote. And I think, other than that, in my bag, ladies, I always keep, like I said, I keep a little gum. There's my chewing gum that I use to keep fresh. And, guys, I did go ahead and just loop a little scrunchie on this bag to show you a little bit of pizzazz on this bag. I have my water bag. So as you see, I can pick up my bag, corral and go, very easily accessible and ready to go. Have my long straps for easy travel. So guys, these are two different styles, two bags. I hope this gives you guys some good ideas. I'm not gonna go through this bag in detail because I set it up about the same, but this one has the same, a little more, um, a little cleaner in this one this one doesn't have quite as much as minimal but I just have a book um, it also has of course something to take notes so I have a little clipboard pad there and then a planner down in this bag so guys I hope this works helps you to understand how you can easily organize your bag if you are more in the um, not in the corporate world but you're on the go and you need snacks you need whatever to sustain you through the day organize your bag to fit your personal needs if you like a bag that's flirty that's fine if you're not even a bag person and you want to do a book bag like a backpack find a nice backpack and organize it guys so i hope this has helped you all i will be bringing you all more content like this please drop your comments in the comment section i will try to find links to most of the supplies in the bag as well as a link to similar products please don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next video